Good frosty morning everybody. Um, at the moment I'm preparing for a little mini trip. It's gonna start today and I gotta get back into the habit of making videos regularly after the Christmas break so to say. Um, I hope we had a nice Christmas. I definitely had a nice one. I'm a, I think I'm about 10 kilos heavier than before. No actually not. Uh, but I'm gonna try my best to document this little trip here and we're gonna do some awesome bouldering now I still need to get some groceries and we are also gonna utilize the van for that so yeah I'm really pretty excited that it's there but it wasn't there so yeah lost about half an hour there I think I should have enough gas left in the small in the small package Kadoschen we say in German um, so yeah that should be enough for two meals or something so yeah it should be enough for this little mini trip and yeah I hope that this kind of foggy foggy conditions clear out up a bit we're gonna visit an area which is actually quite close to the Danube and I hope it's not too cold, not too moist, you know, so the bowl is dry and the rock is of high quality. Um, I think I'll catch you guys later when we hit the... I think I'll catch you guys later when we hit the rock and now I will accelerate here a little bit so it's getting a little bit more loud in the car, you know. And yeah, then it's gonna be harder and harder to make these talks I guess so it's gonna be interesting to see if the audio is any good on this clip so yeah don't judge me on that it's just an experiment all right we are now at cruising speed fasten your seat belts make yourself a comfortable uh, position and pretty foggy also in the bouldering area also quite cold I think we're gonna meet up with Danny the Beast. Maybe you still know him from from an episode quite a while ago, actually. And yeah, let's see what we can do in these conditions. Danny! David, Servus. Servus. Is that good? So we are here at the world famous Scarabeo boulder and we just warmed up on the finish because the finish is actually the crux and it's super, oh, it's just super moves on oh man. I think I'm gonna drop off there quite often but yeah, um, time, to, you in the camera in okay. time to get my hands on the start.
right, so now we start falling on the crux move again. That means the serious attempt can begin. get to the crux in my first attempt I only have two attempts then I need to make a bigger rest again okay and I never get to the first to the crux on my first attempt because I make some stupid mistake in the lower part with the hook since uh, something slips off all the time and this just costs enough energy so that I fall at the crux move on my second attempt so yeah the challenge for me is to not mess up in the first attempt in the lower part to get to the crux it's also a very long boulder problem, so when you get to the crux once, you need to make a bigger rest because otherwise it makes no sense. Because there's so many moves and so much compression and so much body tension, I don't know. You just need a bigger rest. So yeah, let's do a bigger rest and then let's give it one more try. <laughs> Stop believing. So I thought, well, I already have kind of the sloper um, acclimatization now from this uh, compression Scarabeo A day thing. And this is another sloper uh, thing, another sloper problem. So why not just try this right away? And I should be warmed up for it. And uh, yeah, let's get the beta going and then let's make some goals. How could it be any different? Why the 
fishing from the hook day. so beautifully today it's just so nice to watch I'm sure okay the key to this boulder is good sequence memory and a really nice brush to the pull of the slope and today I have neither of both It was definitely one of the sickest scents so far. Zero chalk on my fingers. I don't know what's up with these conditions. Take a look at that. I think we've got a very high moisture. Enough rambling. Let's let's head down. All right, guys. Uh, welcome back to the van. The plan was actually to do a little overnight today, but um, the weather forecast for tomorrow is pretty sh So the alternative looks like driving home and making a hangboard session, making a rest day tomorrow and coming back on the weekend. I've got my post-workout meal here, nothing special, some lentils in a can. And yeah, then I'm gonna head home, I hope we don't get into too much traffic jam. It was a good session today. I'm pretty happy, 1A, 17C. Um, yeah, let's make another hangboard session and then rest. Mm. So the repeater session is done. Scored a new personal best, um, 83.1 kilograms of bonus weight. No, of course not, of total weight on these um, repeaters. And I managed to do three sets of these. And then I completely dropped off because I'm already empty from the bouldering. But anyways, um, I'm back in the business, guys. A lot of new videos are gonna come up. Um, the Christmas break is over, so to say. Um, and yeah, we're gonna have some awesome event adventures, I think, as well. And I'm waiting for something on Amazon, from Amazon, actually, which is gonna be effing awesome, I tell you. Um, but it's gonna take some time until it arrives, so yeah, I gotta be a little bit patient there. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a great time as well. And until then, I'll see you soon. Bye.